Hey guys, quick tutorial how we can create yeah this geometric sculpture uh, shape. And yeah, I'm just the translator of <laughs> this guy here, Easy Cat Solutions. So yeah, I'm just recreating it in plasticity. Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. So it's also very easy. So just let's start with a new scene. So first of all, we have to create the cube. Go here to the middle, press tab. So it's yeah, it's same size here. And bring it just up somewhere. And now let's put uh, all everywhere 500 centimeters. Press OK. And now we have to first of all create a new line and snap it to this edge and to this edge. So it goes like in the middle, right click. And we will need it, um, yeah, uh, late for some later operations. Mm, and now select this cube, press Shift D. So you duplicate it. Just bring it with GG somewhere a little bit out. And now press V. So you can attach this um, gizmo pivot thing at this edge. And now press again G and with control clicks snap it to the other edge of this other cube. Right click to confirm. Now go to face mode. Select this face. Press O to offset it. And we have to offset it uh, 100 centimeters. So one fifth. Uh, right click. So we have something like this and now face mode, select this face, press E to extrude and now B for new body because we need a new body and we also have to extrude it like inwards also 100 centimeters. So we have here this body separately. Um, the same here on the top, select this face, press O, 100 centimeter offset, select this face, press E, and uh, press B so you create a new body and again 100 centimeters right click to confirm and now select those yeah main cubes and press H or you can even delete them because we don't need them anymore and now yeah we have to establish the form and for that we will select this body radial array around this point here in the middle and yeah you see yeah, we are getting something really cool, but we just need three of them. So you see, we're getting something like that. Okay. And the same here, select this body radial array, select this point, three number. And now just uh, select all of those bodies, Q, Q to Boolean them. So we have one body. I press Alt Z, so I don't have uh, X-ray mode. And for now, I just hide also this line here. And now I go to the right view or better I just create a corner rectangle from this edge to this edge and now we have to create yeah those angle angular shapes and for that first of all we go to the right view and we will create because we will revolve it a, a bit but for that we need a yeah helping construction line so I just create a line um, and snap it here to this edge and this line has to be 400 so a fourth so four fifth of this line here and just okay and uh, snap it here to the z axis and now also create a new line and just drag it here outwards so we can use this as a revolve and yeah now you can select this face and go here to the revolve and snap it to to this point here and drag it out on the Y axis. And we only need 90 degrees. Perfect. So we have something like this. We can delete, uh, delete those curves here and also this curve. And now we take this body, press G, press V to attach this gizmo here. And with G again and control click, we will snap it here. Right click. So we have a nice connection. So now we have to connect also all of those other corners. And for that, we also need again here our line here. So I select this piece and again radial array around this edge. And this time we also again need only three. Perfect. So we have something like this and OK. And now we can deselect this line here. And now we have to select them all those objects, press QQ, right click and perfect. And also press just two. So you're only selecting the edges and now you can select all of those edges. Press B to create a nice little bevel. 
and make it a positive value. And yeah, perfect. <laughs> that was quick and fast. And if you want to learn more, I have launched my new in-ear headphones modeling and Octane render course as an extension. We will create this body and those cool uh, product design renders. So check out first link in the description. And yeah, if you like those kinds of videos, leave a like and subscribe and see you in the next one.